Okay, we're live. Picking up where we left off last time. Um, we did Kakariko Village at twilight. And after that was after the Forest Temple, which we also did. So we're supposed to go to Death Mountain and deal, figure out what's wrong with the Gorons. Apparently they're not just eating corrupted rock brisket this time. Spend some time climbing up this thing with no stamina meter, thankfully. Take note, folks. Alright, so you have to do that once. Hopefully it doesn't cause a game over, because... Took half a heart of damage there. Back week. Easy horse. Nice little rendition of Epona's song there. Oh god. Okay. We did it right that time. This horse more or less obeys you, take note, Breath of the Wild, Tears of the Kingdom nonsense. Hey 
Ow. Okay. Not quite what I. Oh my god. Why? Walk in straight line, please. Okay. Is completely gone. Alright, so to get past that Goron, you need two things. The ability to sumo wrestle and the iron boots. Well, that went poorly, but that's practice how it goes. Hey! 
Got him. Got a pretty good handle on this. But we still need the iron boots, so... for a couple things there. Somehow. But we'll get that on the way back. We're gonna do this. Hey, EJ, how's it going? Let's do some goat herding. Is but no 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 you're going in get back in. Okay, I was gonna say this has gone better than I could have imagined, but that happened at the end.
But I think we only needed that to be in... Okay, so we've got stuff to get done now. Um, this stupid bridge, man. Why does it have trouble with it? I think we missed a couple bugs and one heart piece in this little trek earlier that we kind of zipped through pretty quickly. This is Kakariko Gorge. It's just not marked as such on the map, I guess. Yeah, okay. Southeast portion. Not do a bug catching net, it just
There it is. I see it. Alright, we are at six out of six heart pieces. to do that um let's please oh it's gonna railroad me into this now i mean it's not that important anyway but it's just going to learn that skill wait i did that didn't i no, it's at the Orden Spring that that stone is, okay. King Blobin. All right, so. Yeah, fine, you've got a hostage. Come on, let's fight. really use a blow right now. Oh, 
Oh god. Overturned. Overturned. Got him. Okay, so sent him packing. Oh, geez, we're here now. Okay, bridge time. Oh, this. Okay. Right, this jousting thing. Jesus, what are you doing? Circle back around. Oh god, you lose an entire heart for that. That's so dumb. Jeez, what? God, that's... I have to also get a hit off there. So annoying. Jesus. Like, if they didn't have the lose an entire heart penalty, like, this might be a good little mini game here. Alright, turn around, come on. How? How are you supposed to hit that? That's so stupid. I hit the pig. Turn it around, come on. Let's do this one more time. There we go, okay. Now we need to do that probably two more times, I wanna guess. Two, one more time, okay. I was worried about taking the hit there, so. Nope, didn't have it quite there. Wrong button. I don't know if that actually works even, but... If it did, it would be pretty good, because... Like, I'd really love to just shoot him with a bow and arrow. Like, that seems like the way to approach this fight, if this game was being a little more sensible here. There we go. 
into the gorge with you, buddy. Okay. Okay, so the first thing we actually need to do is go back to the previous area. Because we missed one more thing there. We saved this kid. We don't really care that much. So tempted to skip cutscenes here. Sorry, kid is saved. We are jetting back to the spring at the previous area to do that stone and get our new sword technique. Seriously, can you not, like... God, I don't care right now. I'm trying to get somewhere, and you are interrupting. Oh my god, fast travel is much better once you can freely change between wolf form and human form. And you probably never need to use the horse again, but... Okay, cool. Alright, so back at the spring here, we're going to heal up real quick and talk to that stone. Talk to the wolf, rather. The stone was what made the wolf appear. Okay, so...
Okay, so... Where horse? Oh right, it's in the next area. Assuming that she stayed there. Oh god, I have to call her, don't I? Bottle for that, okay. Um, <laughs> shit. All right, let's reset this puzzle.
guide told me one of those graves had a yellow rupee in it. It did not tell me that the other had a Poe in it that I have no means of dealing with yet. So, that's fun. Multiple Poe's. Fun. Jesus H. Christ! Like... Okay, good. Lot coming after me in here. I do not like this place. Oh. There was a thing here to do a thing. How many rupees do we have right now? I 399, okay. I hope that's not some maximum that we were allowed to carry at the time. Cool, okay. Um... Sun song, please. Please tell me I can stay here for free. For God's sake. Like, I can see what they're going for with trying to make a world feel more alive with these time restrictions, but it doesn't add anything to the gameplay. Like, it really doesn't. Just putting barriers in front of the player like this is not helping gameplay in any way. And I have to wait for the stupid clock to move.
my god, this is so utterly dumb. Why do you not have a way to f advance the time? My god, how stupid can you be with this? Like... <sighs> so utterly stupid. Just give players a way to advance the time if you have these stupid time-bound mechanics. There is absolutely no reason to even have this day-night cycle in this game. Let alone lock shit behind it. Time for this crap. How is it still night time? Jesus. This is absolute garbage. My god. How is it night time? Just turn to day already. Jesus Christ. How stupid can you be with this? Twilight Princess Day Night Cycle. It's supposed to only be seven minutes, Jesus Christ. What is wrong with these people? Oh my god. Still night. <sighs> I 
Okay. That was absolutely awful. It was absolutely... I mean, maybe it became night because of how much time I spent wandering around that the game... that the people who wrote the guide didn't run into because I backtracked a lot more to get stuff I missed, but... whatever. Okay, this has been a disaster so far. We've got six bugs. Okay. Okay, we already got that. Good to know. All right, so we've got our boots. We've got our sumo wrestling mad skills. Now we can head up this mountain. If I do find another ferry at any point, I will definitely swap out what I did where I took uh, the bee larvae for the ferry, because I'm five hearts is not a lot. Get wrecked, sir. Okay, that one does not try to run you off, it just rolls into you. Doesn't even say excuse me, how rude. Okay, he's... They're clearly trying to stop me from getting here, so that makes a little more sense. So freaking rude. Wow. 
Got hit a lot there, honestly. Jesus Christ! How does nothing drop hearts? Okay. I guess they don't call this place Death Mountain for nothing. For crying out loud! Let me pick up the hearts that just came out of a box. Holy shit, guys. <sighs> it's that kind of night, huh? I don't think that's how volcanoes work. They don't home in on you. God. Except we do it properly and we, oh, okay, we can do this this way too. It has to stop eventually, right? Right? <sighs> this f oh wait, um, we can hop down here. Okay, so we climb up this, we're past it, and we can keep going. Get this guy to bounce us up. Wow, 
Wow, I do not approve of this place. <sighs> That's so dumb. That's so freaking stupid. Okay, it's clearly locked on to you, so that's... Oh my god. So unprecedentedly freaking stupid. Just let me in the damn dungeon already. Dungeon is actually pretty cool. It's, makes very clever use of the iron boots. But here we gotta do this again. Gorons are a lot more chill here. Being in a hot spring will do that, I guess. Hey, Tomba, you made it. Shield bash to the face. Don't know if I can get past that. So we just gotta find another way. Because that got really dumb last time. Um. Oh, the boots, right. Yeah. Okay. That's what we need for this. Dum-de-dum-de-dum. -dum. Walk right through that geyser. Okay. That's what I forgot to do. Get wrecked, sir. You, sir, are going to be the bridge that I walk over to get where I need to go. Shield bash, good. Alright, is this the dungeon? Alright, I think it is. Time for some more sumo wrestling.
Time for more sumo wrestling. They did. They really did. Oh, got to put my boots on first, I guess. For crying out! Okay. Got him. Get wrecked, sir. All right, so the Gorons are a little messed up right now. This time it's not because they ate some funky brisket. Hey. Okay. Software update? That is a thing that does happen. Oh shit, let me equip the Hylian shield that I bought. Forgot that I actually need to equip it. That seems important. Oh fuck. That... Ow.
Okay, it's not gonna do a cutscene thing for it anymore. That threw me off a bit. Where I was before. Never mind. Okay, so this way apparently goes nowhere. Or... Ow, rude. So freaking rude. So that opens that. We can make another mad dash here. Alright, so, get another one of these torch slugs, or three of them out of the way, apparently.
Smoke here. Clock called, they want their gears back. Whew, okay, that's tricky timing there. Use our key here. Alright, they don't explode, so that's a plus. Dodongo dislikes smoke. Alright, uh... Doo -doo -doo -doo. That's actually one place where it's like really good to have that one attack where you do the rolling thing and... Sla the rolling slash thingy. Fuck. Ow. Ah! Okay. Another Dodongo. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Whoa! That was... Made it. Sure hope that's not a one way. Okay, so those platforms are electrified and you can use the iron boots to walk on them. It's a pretty cool mechanic, in all honesty. They do also have the classic sink to the bottom with the iron boots and breathe. And that's how that works. There was something over... Okay, it's magnetic, not electrified.
dungeon map. This is a good way to do progression in a dungeon, finding the different pieces of the key. It makes it a little less linear, I guess. Go break all their furniture. <sighs> okay, so we got the dungeon map. Wait, 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 wait. I hear that. I know that sound. Maybe. Huh, maybe it's not here. I don't know if I care that much, honestly. Okay, there's a ladder here, that's what it is. Yeah, that seems... ...important. There we go. Alright, so we've got this guy... ...brings us the Uku, or whatever you pronounce this weird deranged thing as. particular note here on the other side. I'm not on the ceiling, you are! So 
and now we walk all the way around. Looking back on this game, they probably got some of their ideas for Super Mario Galaxy out of this, honestly. With the walking on the ceiling and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Some definite ideas with all that. Alright, so we go to the center of this room, we fight some globins. start doing stuff and we're gonna let it take us to the north part of the room where is it gonna pick us up though ah Get wrecked. Then we get another crane going, I guess. We got hit once, oh no. Okay. So. Getting them out of the way first. Of course, not if I fall in the water. Not breathe under the water yet, but we can breathe for long enough to grab this. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> 
Iron boots on, iron boots off. And now we're on the wall. So we walk up here. Drop down. Grab whatever's in here. More rupees. Sweet. That opens that door, which we have to get there before it closes. So let's run on through. Alright, we don't have the thing to deal with those guys yet, so instead we're gonna go the other way and not pay that much mind to them yet. Doink! Go up this here wall. Part. And I think we go right this time. Jesus. God. Okay. Where am I? Okay, he walks so slowly in these boots, but they're fulfilling a legitimate puzzle need, I feel like. That opens that door. deal with those so let's just leave them alone for now and open this locked door all right probably something valuable here Thank you. 
not have the key for that yet. Got it. This unlocks a door on the other side of the room. So far the dungeon has gone smoothly, the path leading up to it maybe not so much, but... Oh hey, treasure. Ten rupees, sweet. Walk on this wall until we get where we need to go. As far as like spatial design, this lets them design passages, not just be floors between rooms, in that you can. Like maybe more than any of the other dungeons, they use this to such good effect in this dungeon, I feel like. Oh god, what? Okay, that was... <sighs> Definite control confusion right now of like what, which button is going to send you which way. Okay, back on the floor, good. More rupees. <laughs> Mini boss. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay. Crap, wasn't fast enough. I can't tell when I'm in range and when I'm not right now. Why? Why would you throw him that way? I was pressing! Like, what are they thinking with this? Jesus! God! I hate this! WHY ARE YOU THROWING HIM THAT WAY?! I PRESS LEFT, DO NOT THROW HIM RIGHT! Sure, why the fuck not? Throw the exact opposite of the direction I'm pressing! What sense does that even make?! God damn fucking shit! Why the fuck do you not grab when I press the fucking grab button, you stupid- Jesus Christ! That was fucking stupid. Okay, we got past that. If I can please get the bow now. Slingshot will never be used again. Congratulations.
not I did not remotely press that button I don't know why it's doing that all right so we destroy all these we get the goods compass All right, this is going to be our third guy. Last key shard. With the compass, we can see what treasure chests we don't have yet also. There isn't much, just some stuff in that one room. They probably all reset now. No? Okay. Good. We go through this way. wants us to go over there. contrived here, but yeah, you roll into the gate to knock it down. Yeah. 
Come on, walk off the edge, walk off the edge, do it for me. Okay. That would've been funny if another one did it. Nice ambush, buddy. Pity it didn't work. So this is where we start, and it drops us down here a little. Drops me here. Where? What? Did 
I do this wrong? Door to the north. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, we have the bow now, so we can do... What can we do? Ah, okay, got it. This is something that you couldn't do before because you didn't have the bow. Because the slingshot can't reach this. Except, do. Gotta actually set up the angle first. There. Alright, and the BMOS we can also deal with just fine now. Assuming that doesn't break my aiming. place. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. Next up is a room we were in earlier. And now we have a bow, so, like, we can shoot at all those buildings that were shooting at us earlier, and that's pretty cool. Please, I have a bow now. You don't have the same control that you did before. So there's a couple treasure chests in this room. And then there was the Beamos that we avoided earlier. There's still more of those guys, huh? How about that? Go here now. Huh. <laughs> 
Got it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Is that an instant game over? Fuck you. My god, what the fuck? How is that an instant game over? Screw that shit. My god. Like, yes, I realize I was underwater for a while there, but, like... <sighs> it counted us as getting the treasure chest at least, which is... What we actually needed to get done there, just so it wasn't marked on the map anymore. Not that the Mayverse is there to use it, that stupid stamp anymore. Congratulations, Mayverse. You resulted in another, in another death on my counter. I hope you're happy. Okay, the other chest is something we can't get yet, oddly. Go one more cycle. God damn it! I pressed the wrong button to take the fucking boots off, and then when I did take the boots off, it I was out of position. God damn shit. I'm all the way back here now because of god damn buttoning. Obviously, I wanted to take the boots off. It should have known that even though I pressed the wrong button. <sighs> Sweet mother of God. Like... This was way more of an ordeal than it had to be.
I have speculation that they're gonna bring me a fairy in one of these chests is why I'm apparently completely wrong about, but Well, they managed to, to defy my Zelda sense. That's unfortunate, but... stuff in Kakariko Village after we finish up here. Okay. Yeah, boss fight. like this God Okay Got him 
it's super finicky to grab that thing while also dodging him and wearing the stupid iron boots, but thankfully the actual slashing goes fairly well. And I didn't lose too many hearts because I had no healing. Alright, that's our second fused shadow. So we're going to do a little more cleanup in Kakariko Village now. All right, so, uh, we have... <laughs> Doo -doo -doo -doo. We got 
other thing. Now that the Gorons are back in town. Something else here. Okay, so Gonna grab this here purple rupee. Takes us to almost four hundred rupees. Put a lot into the vertical part of Kakariko Village. Seventeen arrows, great. There we go. Huh? 
Ah, oh, there it is. Part number 10. And then over here there was this entryway. Still got a while till Fall Guys time, so we've got more things to find.
Okay, so... And, you know, let's just climb it. I didn't press forward when he launched me, so... But we're not gonna go up the main trail here, we're gonna... Find another Goron here and, and get launched up to the left. Just like that. Okay. You again. I already bought the bomb back. Thank you. Bye. Uh, 
Ah, right, bombs. Okay, bombs open this up. Cool. So this is a, one of these caves that's full of random crap. Rupee. There's a Poe here that we can't deal with yet.
letter O for a Miiverse thing that the servers don't exist for anymore. That's fun. And over here we've got just a dead end. Oh. Uh, let's go ahead and in this case... No. <laughs> Refill the lantern and get a spare bottle of yellow chew jelly. <laughs> and we're done here. that part of Hyrule Field that has the Bridge of Elton in it? something else. This is... Jesus. my god. I would not expect this in a, like, as recent as the Wii U version of this game is to have these issues with the horse. Like, that would be something that you would just, like, iron out a little bit in a remaster like this. Okay, we're here. Northwest portion of the field, right in the open. Gonna be 
Getting four bugs and a piece of heart here. Grasshopper. Also use this way to get between these two areas apparently. Okay, so, um... Boulders that you can blow up. 
Yeah, okay, that's what it wanted. They didn't look like the right color to blow up, but... I see it. Ha! <laughs> 
Oh. Okay. It's up there somewhere. Thank you. 
All right, so for bugs, we are at 10 out of 24. So that is where we're going to stop for tonight. Um, the next time it gets into the Lanairu province and starts the arc that goes toward the next dungeon, which leads into the halfway point of the story. And then, I don't know what the schedule is going to be for this, but probably not going to do all three of those in one go like I did last time. Anyway, that is going to do it for tonight, folks. I will see you in another timeline.